Hello. Welcome to my stream. I'm Rebecca. <clears throat> happy, happy, happy Friday. It is uh, five Friday, five Friday. So you have to have five items <clears throat> that are on my desk, on my desk. There's paint, no more than three colors of your paint of choosing. Um, you have to have a stencil, a napkin, a paper punch, and book paper. So I'm going to give it a little time, let everybody come in and say hello. Hello, hello, hello. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, Brenda. Hi, Diana. Diana, you... You playing today? You're gonna do some mixed media? Got me some coffee in my hummingbird cup. Oh, it's nice and hot. I remembered to warm up my cup before I put my coffee in there. I have some goodies, 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 goodies. Um, my, uh, my uh the paper turned out beautiful and um yeah beautiful i have packages to open but of course the first thing we're gonna do is the uh friday five so we're gonna let some people show up let me see if i can find if you didn't find the stuffs you can still play with the stuffs that you have it's okay just to get you craft and I don't care I don't care if you use you know your coffee spill some coffee spill some coffee on some paper let's get this stuff going what about you Brenda we're gonna talk you into doing some mixed media you want to do some mixed media with us today I realized I only picked out <laughs> one like paint stuff but Remember, the point is, is uh, you have to use these. You can add to it. That's I've changed that up since our very first one. You can uh, use other things besides these. You just have to use these to be complete. So by the end of everything, those have to be done. And I did not. Guess what I didn't do? The new ones. I forgot to. We'll just, we'll leave those in there as non-painted this week. I got to get those painted. Lori. Hey, Lori. Not today. Everything's out in the shed. <laughs> All right, Lori. Well, I'm glad you're here. And Tina. Hey, Tina. I'm running to my craft room. <laughs> Hurry up. Get your running shoes on. I put my slippers on, so I'm ready. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you guys are here. Yay, yay, yay. We're going to see if anyone else is on. Wonder, uh, let me see if I can let, uh, let a couple people that sometimes hang out with us, see if they want to come over and do Friday Fives. If I can remember their names on here. Uh, I'm gonna join. There we go. Let's see. Diana, could you uh, could you uh, do with the link on to my Facebook group if you don't mind? The W word. Ew. Trying to see who all hangs out with me. Not very many <laughs> people hanging out with me. All righty. Thank you, Diana. I appreciate it. 
Lori, did you make, or uh, not Lori, I'm sorry. Uh, Tina, did you make it? Oh, there we go. She's there now. Whew, you made it. So um, I don't think you played with us before. So um, pretty much you have your five items. And we do mix medium media. I pull something here. Now, the rules have changed a little bit. Oh, Storm, don't knock that over the, since the beginning. But how we do it now is these are the five items that you have to use in the project, but you can use other stuff too. But you're not done until you've used all these five items. So don't like not use these items throughout the, throughout the, the sticks because what could happen is the last stick you're using all of them and that might not look very nice just saying <laughs> so <laughs> but uh so yeah so if if you have any questions throughout the thing ask we'll answer it there's no there's really no rules except by the end of the the stick picking and we pick uh anywhere from five to ten sticks usually um uh, i think last week we did ten sticks but I picked them out beforehand. I did not do that this time. We're gonna, we're just gonna go random this time. We're gonna just let you guys, or not, well, you, you, they were still random last time, but yeah, where's our Allison? Allison usually is a good sticker. Deidre, she's a good stick picker. I wanna make sure, um, Make sure if there's some people that want to play, can get in here. Um, so uh, just to go real quick, you need a you need a uh, hole pun uh, punch, but it can be any kind of punch. If you only have this kind of punch, that's fine. Those that that works is what needs to be done. You know, you might just punch one little hole and stick it on there and say, "Hey, I used it." That's that's fair. I'm not going to say that's cheating. That's fair. Uh, your three colors of paint. I don't care what colors or what kind of paint. If you picked out three spray paints or three acrylic paints or three finger paints, I don't care. Just three paints. Now you can add color on. You can add more paint. But you have to have at least three paints. I have to think about how, to, how we're going to do that one. But yeah, you can add more paints on. Uh, a napkin. This is the one I picked. Probably not the best with the colors. So no, not too bad. But I picked a napkin. I thought if I needed to add a border, guys, I'm horrible at borders. This one's got, well, it's got some of a border. There we go. Uh, stencil. Oh, you want to say hi to the girls? Guess who came to say hi? He just gave me you. Okay. All right. Hi. Yes. Okay. There's your paw. Yes. Uh, no kisses. Please don't kiss me on the face. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Don't. That's probably why my desk is broke right in there. Big fat butt. Here's your pretty face. Yes. Oh. Is that, that's Jughead. Everyone say hi to Jughead. He likes to come say hi to you girls. Actually, I think it's just to get his face scratched. Yeah, hi. Such a handsome boy. Were you outside? Were you outside? You're a good boy. You are a good boy. He's disabled also. He has a disabled foot. He had to have a toe removed when he was a pup. My disabled puppy, huh? Yes, you run funny. But you can still run, huh? Yeah. You can still run. All right. Your coat is so pretty. It's so shiny. You ready? Can I go now? Can I play? Yeah, the girls are waiting for me. The girls are waiting. Okay. All right, get down. Get down. Go find, no, go find your go find a stick or bone or please stop. Okay. Look at I don't want my wrist in your mouth. People will think you're biting. And no armpit licking. Oh my gosh, you're gross. Go. There's storm. Look. Oh, there's storm. There's storm. Right there. Go play with her. All right. Thank you. I love you too. Look at all your dog hair. All right. Love you. Bye-bye. Oh. Look, we're showing everybody my 
boobs and little belly. All right, guys, here we go. There's Jughead. <laughs> Tina says, hi, Jughead. I oh, wonder if Diana missed you. And <clears throat> here's my paper. And you have to have a paper. That was the last thing before Jughead so rudely interrupted us. But how about this, guys? Is this not perfect for the timing of everything? <laughs> it's the, it's so for on here, it's respirator. So that's going to be part of my, it's going to, that's memories. It's going to go in, into the, I'm going to work it in somewhere. That's going to be my book page. So um, I just sew my paper. I just sew it because... Uh, then you can put thicker things on. It doesn't seep through. Although this paper works pretty good. And it doesn't warp as bad. That's why I use gesso. Again, I'm not a training channel. I'm not teaching you anything. I don't know if <laughs> that's right or wrong. Yeah, I don't know why his coat's so shiny. <laughs> How happy it is. We feed him, I think he eats neutral. I think that's what he gets. So, I mean, it's not like junk junk. Uh, food, but it's not like real, real high quality food. Um, can't afford real high quality, but yeah, I think his, he's always had such a pretty coat, such a pretty coat. His mama is light colored. So his daddy, he must, I'm thinking his daddy must have been a uh, chocolate lab because his mama definitely is a pit bull. But he has a lot of the same, like when his ears are flopped back, when he runs and his ears end up flopped back, um, he definitely, like if his ears were chopped, he looks really like a pit. But uh, when his ears are down and he has those really sad eyes looking at you, it's like, oh my gosh, that the lab comes straight out. Straight out of Compton. That's Shannon. Shannon's straight out of Compton. That's where she lived in California when she was little. Brenda, you got me all worried about my table now. So I'm being, trying to be really, really careful until I can get Shannon in here to, to see if, it's, uh, if they're bending or what's going on. It's not as heavy, the weight, I took all the weight off of it. Well, not all the weight, but like all the heavy stuff that was on it, because it was getting really piled up. Cleaned it off again, not, and then I did it before Monday, guys. Woo -woo -woo. So I put, uh, I put a layer of gesso on my paper. So if you want to do that, you can. If you don't have any gesso, I used to make gesso with, um, oh, what did you use? I think um, it's, uh, uh, white paint. Uh, marble dust. Or some people use baby powder. I bought some marble dust. It's not expensive. Um, and if you're interested in some marble dust, um, drop me a line on Facebook or something. I can send you some in a Happy Meal because I do have a big container of it and you do not need much. I don't remember. I would We would have to look at, up a recipe. You can find them either on Google, you can find them on, uh, on, yeah, on uh, YouTube, but it's going to be white paint, uh, marble dust, and I believe the other thing is just water. And then you make it the consistency you like. I finally found some on clearance on sale. Well, it wasn't on clearance. It was on sale on, uh, I think it was like Black Thursday or Happy Monday or whatever they call it on. Uh, oh, no, it was during the Amazon, you know, their special thingy that they do. Yes, friend, I took lots of weight off. I did, girlfriend. So, um you're interested though let me know and we can I'll, I can get you a little baggie full which is all you need it just puts a little bit of grit in there because it grabs the different uh, it makes your paper not real smooth and it gives it a little bit of texture to let uh, paints grab or glue grab or you know whatever grab but let me know if and when you are ready Sorry, somebody. J 
Jug Jug, what are you crying about? No, you were outside. I let you in. You can lay down for a little bit. So, so that I know who's all playing. Dina, you're playing, right? You're, not, you're in your craft room. Diana, you playing? There you go, Brenda Tooth. You know, everyone's so picky about the words I use. Tooth, locked, you know, whatever, people, whatever. <laughs> Give us something to skip to. I think that's just as good. All right, Tina's playing, not playing because Lori has to go to work. I'm sorry, Lori. Do you work every Friday or is it kind of, it changes? Maybe one of these Fridays we can get you in. Or we'll do it on, a, if you're off every Thursday, maybe we'll switch up one week. We'll do it on a Thursday. Friday, five's on a Thursday. I make the rolls around here. We can do whatever I want. We'll confuse everybody. Everybody wants to call it Friday. Won't do it again. Oh, Brenda, I'm teasing. You know that. <laughs> Please do. I don't mind education. I love learning. I love I love me getting me some educated. I like to think and I like to impress people and be like, oh, yeah, I graduated sixth in my class. Yes, I did six in my class. And then they find out how many kids were in my class. Not so good. All right. We lost Diana. She went to put my this on the page and she's out of here. Maybe she's trying to gather stuff up. Are you ready for the first stick, Lori, since you're playing? Well, in the, if you're not playing playing by painting, you can play by picking the color of the stick. And if you're playing painting, you can pick the color of the stick, too. I'm just saying that you don't have to be arting to pick sticks, if you know, if you know what I mean. Hey, Eva, good morning. You can play. We haven't started. We haven't started, Eva. If you want to play, you are you got time. Just let me know when you are ready, and we'll move on. All we've all I did was just so a piece, just so a piece of paper. And if you have an art room, which I think I I know you uh, through through different things, you should have an art room. Finding the five stuff that you need won't be an issue. You just need a punch paint. Stencil, napkin, or tissue paper, something like that, in a book page. So it's not, it's, it, it wouldn't take much for you to, to, to jump in and, and join the party. All right, so let's get, <clears throat> let's get this party started. I need a, um, I need someone to pick the first color. I do have plain. Um, so we have plain and we have all these colors this week. I have gold, orange, green, pink, purple, plain, uh, blue, yellow. Did I say them all yet? Yellow, gold, red, green, light green, dark green, light green, dark green, orange, blue, green, plain, white. I have white in here too. Uh, blue, pink. Uh, plain green orange orange all right I'm gonna stick them in here and I'm gonna pick an orange I'm gonna pick this orange right here and it says use purple you can use anything that's purple you can use purple paint you can use purple crayon you can use purple paper purple whatever first thing on your page is gonna be something purple purple okay and I'm gonna get, get this thing out of the way and use this Purple, gonna, purple, okay. 
Even some purple. So the first thing you do is use purple on your paper. paper. Hey, you know who was isn't here is Michelle. She did it last week, remember? She even posted her picture in the group. Where's she at? to my page wait until you see the pages that came out yesterday from my eco dyeing i'm probably going to do some more because they turned out so good but i took them outside and i let the sun dry them and i think that made even a prettier um because i've used last what i've done in the past um because I put them on my kitchen floor. Well, now I have this dog and uh, the cat, which I was a little worried about Jug messing with them outside, but only uh, one page got, and it didn't even really get ruined, but it got it blew away, and I couldn't get it. And I had to, it had to wait until Shannon got home because it like blew all the way up into the, up into the field. But he didn't jump or walk or anything on him, and I had him right on the on the pad on the on the deck. Wait until you see them; they look so good. Add in purple. That's the first stick, guys. First prompt: Add purple. Ah, purple and gray were my my wedding colors. Purple and gray. My dress was like an ivory color. I guess it was, it was ivory cream. I just took them out of here, my, my wedding pictures, because we were looking at them. When were we looking at them? I think I had them in here yesterday, right? Always, 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 always put too much paint out. Purple, purple rain, purple. Where did we lose? Oh, Deb, are you playing? Lawn, you playing laundry. Deb, you always do laundry. You can come over and do a little bit of my laundry. You can pick colors, Deb, or girl, just a... Uh, Hurry up and stick some purple on some paper and you're playing. You'll do the first prompt, purple. Purple, purple, purple. I's got me some purple, purple, purple. That, there's Diana. Did you get that on in my group, girl? Girl, put some purple on some paper, Diana. Put some purple on some paper. And then you're playing. Purple. Purple, 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 purple. I catch myself doing stuff, guys. I don't, you know, and it's not like I make these noise on purpose thinking, oh, how can I? I catch it's like, oh, shut up, Rebecca. People are going to be crazy and not come back. Although Brenda keeps coming back. Makes me wonder. I love you, Miss Brenda. All right, where's my scrubble? Where's my where's my paper? Okay, so I'm gonna let that dry a minute, and I'm gonna use up some of this purple. And I'm gonna try really hard, Brenda, not to push on my 
table. I'm sure that's what probably did it, is me pushing on it all the time. Well, you guys can't see. I'm just, I'm just over here wasting my wasting the ink, the paint, so that I don't waste it. I'm wasting it, but I'm not wasting it. You know, that's my education. It's coming out. I have this uh, little book that I use for my. Uh, uh, I don't know what the word would be, what, I, what I'm trying to say here. So that just kind of a, a, a book, of, a rub, uh, leftover book, so that I don't like really waste a lot of paint and stuff. So I'll make backgrounds and maybe eventually go in and, and do something with it when I feel kind of artsy, but not want, when I feel an artsy fartsy, but I don't really want to artsy fart, you know. Let me know when you're done adding your purples, your purple smurples. Excess, there's a word. There's a good word we'll use, thanks, Lori. The excess, I rub it off. Thank you, Diana, you got your purple done? You got your purple done, Diana? Get, it, get her done, get her done. You better be playing. You bugged me last night. What do I need for tomorrow? You better be playing. And you better send me a picture when you're done. Oh, yeah. Busted. You can't just be like, oh, yeah, I played. I want a picture of that sucker. It better have purple on it. Okay. Are we good? Yes. You can use anything in addition to those five things, but you have to use those five things that I gave you. Um, yeah, you have to, for your picture, for your piece to be finished, you have to have all five of these things. But right now all we're doing is purple. So you can add purple paper, purple paint, purple something, but the first pick is purple. So does that make sense? And then once they're, hey, Allison, top of the day to you. You playing, Allison? Angie, look at all you guys coming in. Y'all rolling in to play some mixed media. Get the per first pick. You can catch up. Don't be afraid if you just came in. You can catch up. The first, the first thing was purple. You guys are going to, you guys are, it's okay. If this is your first time playing, just play. I just want you to play. That's all. I just want you to do some art today do some crafting do some art get some purple on some paper i don't care if it's purple paint um uh, purple booger anything just get it on the paper and get her done be right back deb's going to get some purple put a purple shirt on we'll call it good Oh, Angie. Okay. Are you going? What do you did, I, You said you had something to do this morning. I remember. I remember. May I interrupt this for it to ask what is the dimensions of your challenge? And is there any particular type of pick you want as a base? Nope. You can do it anywhere you want. <laughs> You're going out, Allie. Yeah, nope. You can do it. This I I um the ones that I have up there are actually um I think they're like eleven by fives or something like that. I've done them on. That's usually this is just my book that I'm doing it in. Um, you know, if you want, you could even get a book like this and it, do them all in these books. And it, especially if you use a paper piece of a thin piece of paper like this, you probably want to get some sort of gesso on there to give it some stability and and give it some, uh, uh, what did we, what did she call it? Not grip. Nope. Brenda, anything, you can do it on anything you want. 
cardboard. Um, I know a lot of people do mixed media on like old cereal boxes. They'll keep their old cereal boxes and then, you know, put it on you because that's nice and thick. So you can put a lot of mixed media stuff on there. You know, if you want to end up putting, because you can use fabric, you can use laces, you can use whatever your little heart desires in mixed media. The prompts just help you give you a way to go. And it also will help you. Some of these prompts might be something you never use. And it's a really good way to teach you to get out of your normal habits. Oh, for my book, girl, I you got to make from our book journal. That is really taking us off, off subject. So we are doing this uh i'm making a little book you take a magazine that is and i'll give you and then you decorate the magazine like we gave her a pretty little dress and a little hat yesterday but you find a something in a magazine and you cut it to we want it we want it to be um six six to six and a quarter by five five and a quarter right and i think let's see that Oh, look, this one's even smaller. Try to keep, okay, try to keep the height to six, six and a quarter and no bigger than five, five and a quarter because this one's five, four and three quarters. So that's the smallest I would say to go. And then I'm going to put them in a book and some people decided they want to send them. So yeah. Hi, Lori. We're doing some mixed media. Oh, look, Allison got going on, girl. She's going to, I'm hiring her as my secretary. Lori, we're doing mixed media. The first prompt, we're doing prompts. The first prompt is purple. So if you want to join in, there's plenty of time to catch up. Plenty of time to catch up. Because you can glue something purple down or anything. Are we ready to move on for everybody that's already kind of been playing? But please, I would love for you to join in. And then you can post it in my Facebook group, which is Create with Becca. And she's paying bills. I'll send you my bills. I need to pay my bills. Yeah. I got my pearl bill. It was it was good. I did so good. For being a week long sales, I did so good because I didn't go to three or four of them because I was like, I got to behave. I got to behave. I didn't get anything last night because one, I don't have a printer. So it's kind of hard to get a digital digi print thing if I don't have a printer. Did you guys get anything that went to Aaron's sale yesterday? Be safe, Angie. Anyone, even if you're not paint, even if you're not playing today, anyone can pick a color. So I just uh, first color person I see pick color. I have gold. I have plain. I have green, orange, yellow, pink, blue, light green, dark green. And if you want to play, the first prompt was purple. Just put something purple down on your paper. Doesn't have to be paint. It could be fabric it can be we're doing mixed media so it can be any type of media that you have in your craft room that's uh i don't have black that's dark blue i don't have light blue oh i do i have a light blue here i didn't realize purple gold yellow yours is huge that's that's why yours <laughs> it's not she probably did the easy ones first. Oh, yellow. I see someone picked yellow. Okay, let me put this back in there. Put the yellow. Yellow. Here's the first yellow I see. And it says add texture. Texture can be anything that puts texture on your page. You can put a piece of string. You can put lace. You can use texture paint. Um, oh, you can use your napkin because your napkin, because this is part of the five five things. So your napkin, you know, you, you can wrinkle up the napkin a little bit and it's gonna give a little bit of texture. And I think that's what I'm gonna do. I think that's what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use my napkin. Heck, you can use your paper punch. You can use your punch 
because once you glue that down, that's going to give a texture. So texture is a real easy one to add. All right. Yeah, I was surprised when I seen it yesterday. Well, what? And then when I opened up and seen how what how much it was, I mean, it was under uh, under thirty five dollars, which, and that's with shipping. So I did not buy much at all. I was shocked. I think on a regular sale, I buy more than that from her. Yeah, I know that's a pretty one, huh? Well, if I can get it separated here. I know, I know that all the different tricks are out there. And I'm stubborn. I'm so stubborn. I'm so stubborn. Hi, Storm. Hi, Storm Storm. I took all I took all the layers from that I I, I pulled off of this. I took them into the living room or into the kitchen and put them in the kitchen. Yeah, if you're lucky. Oh my goodness. I'm so glad I didn't. Ooh, look at how that looks. You can see that through there. Mm, maybe I should do the whole thing. I'm so pretty, oh so pretty, I'm so pretty. Oh wait, no. <laughs> the page is so pretty. Oh, I'm gonna do that. Oh so pretty. All right. Yeah, just feeling this. See that has texture. Yeah, fabric is something. Man, I gotta get my sewing machine up. <laughs> It's buried now. It's buried behind boxes. If I could took all the boxes out of this room from my purchases, I would probably have enough room in here. <laughs> Maybe that needs to be my goal today. Let's try. Get these boxes out of here. Although trash was yesterday. Sorry, I know I'm shaking the table. I'm shaking the table texture guys so whoever's playing get your texture down do it do it and do it now give it much texture but there's texture you can feel it it's not flat usually a bubble of course usually it bubbles up a little bit worse I can feel it makes me happy I thought you wrote Al Allison I thought you wrote <laughs> hello to all my fans I was like no they're my fans just teasing I, I tease you I tease you it's a napkin, Mousy. It's a napkin. Should I use my new? I don't know if these will work. Well, that will take forever. <laughs> Hello, that's for clipping threads. That's a thread clipper. Uh oh, I have it glued to my. Mousy, 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 mousy. Are we catch? Are is people catching up? So now we have you have purple and texture, purple and texture. Purple and texture. That's what you're supposed to have on your paper at this time. Look, Diana ain't saying nothing to me. She's hiding. She's like, oh, I'm hiding. She hides hides from us all the time, guys. Judd, that's so gross. 
Why? Why do you have to lick yourself in here? Go somewhere else and do it. Go somewhere else and lick yourself. You're in the wrong chat room for that. It looks pretty. Pink and purple. Wait, look at the three colors that I picked out that I need to use somewhere. Mixed media, Allison. It's supposed to make you cringe. It's supposed to make you get out of your normal zone. Something that you normally would not do. This type of mixed media. I'm not, we're not talking, we're doing something pretty for, you know, I'm not not pretty because this could turn out pretty. It's um, mash up. It's you're mashing it up or something. I don't know. All right. Lori is going to be busy. Oh, I bought $70 worth of glue and tape on Amazon. <gasps> Holy cow, Lori. Was it any of the glue sticks? What kind of glue did you buy? Is it like your favorite glue? Because I'm always looking for glue. <laughs> Still haven't found found my favorite glue yet are we ready did everyone is anyone that's playing they got their they, do you got your texture down licking is what dogs do along with scratching and sniffing yeah my dog yeah, as you guys know when he comes up here and sits on my lap he licks my armpits he's so gross <laughs> yes i stuck it down with glue stick it's a little wrinkled it's still textured. I can still feel it. If you close your eyes, you can feel it. Yeah, I use glue stick all the time to sit my napkins down. But when you use glue sticks, you you know, it doesn't do the whole, you know, you can't see through it. You know, when you do Mod Podge or something, you paint over top of it, this, it looks more translucent. translucent. But with the glue stick, you know, it just kind of gives it more of the It's pretty translucent with the glue stick they do. Yeah, it's flowers growing on a wire fence. There you go. I I couldn't. The stick pulled me purple. <laughs> Are you trying to cheat over there? Quit trying to cheat. I need a stick. Who wants to pick a color? I, oh, look, I have white, I have plain, gold, green, I have pink, I have white, red, blue, light green, dark blue, red, yellow, orange. Pick a color, any color. And if I'm going too fast, the ones that are playing, just say, oh, I'm not caught up yet. That's all. Just let me know. Don't be afraid to, to shout out. And don't listen to Allison. She don't know. <laughs> oh, you're sued, girl. I'm sending your bill. I'm sending you a bill in the mail. Don't give it to Angie to pay. She has her own bills to pay. Pink some. Put some pink on that, girlfriend. You gotta pick a stick. There is a pink one in here if you're lucky. But you. Gotta pick a stick. And I, I can guarantee you that the pink isn't on the pink stick. I was smart. I, I was smart. What's going on? Who came on? Who came on? Who came on? Someone gonna pick a stick, a pick a stick, a stick. Hopefully I'm not as loud. Okay, so light blue stick. Light blue would be this blue right here. I think I only have the one light blue. And it says hearts. Ooh, that would work with that would work with pink paint, right? Or pink paper. If I use pink, if I use, well, this is red. Red apple. Ah. 
I could cheat and get pink and then call it glitter paint. It's pink paint with red glitter in it. This might work. Oh, it's red. Don't do as I do, do as I say. I'm the boss over here. This is a pretty pink. Oh, and then I'm not cheating. You're so smart. That's why I keep you around. You're so smart. That's and then I can then I claim that I use my paint. Oh, you are so dang smart. Look at you. Always thinking. Okay, so I need. Okay. Hearts. Because you know my drawing hearts aren't that great. Okay, red. Red. Ew. That's way too much red. I always look too much red. Where's my non gloss paint? That's what I, I want to know. Oh, well. Oh, I have a little bowl to mix this stuff into. I'm mixing over here to the side, guys. Ooh, way too much paint. I'm going to be dabbing this crap off for hours and hours and hours. I don't know what I was thinking of when I was painting the wall. Do, 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 pink, guys. Oh, no, not pink, at hearts. Doesn't matter. You can use, you can do your hearts, whatever color you want. Allison decided. I need hearts. No, pink. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. All right. I think that's as good as it's going to get. Okay. Okie dokie. Pink hot. What did Shannon throw away? Did I say something? Probably said something. I didn't even realize I said it. I'm going to put hearts, I think, in here. I think so. Sorry, I'm not really sure about this pink. Pink hearts. Pink hearts are for me. Pink hearts are for you. I've got a pink heart on my mind. And usually your piece starts looking really good around prompt seven. <laughs> Okay, hearts. That was easy enough. You can, you can, you can. I don't even know 
what to do with all that. I think it just needs to be smashed. I'm gonna just smash it on here. Ugh, bug. What a heck of a mess. Ooh, smash and smear. Smash and smear. Smash and smeared. All right. Okay. Oh, all the pink threw you off. Allison, darn you. <laughs> it's okay. Do you need time to catch up? Ooh, they like, oh, nice. I don't even know what you, I don't know what you girls are talking about. I'm going to just sit over here and, and uh, ignore every, ignore the people behind the branches. That's going to be pretty. Um, so I haven't used my paper, um, my punch, two colors. Good, because this is, cannot be called finished. Okay, so the next next color, I need a, I need a, a plain purple, gold, yellow, pink, green, white, plain, orange, dark blue, light green, dark green, gold. I think I said it all. Oh, she threw away my non glass. Oh, I gotcha. I see what you're saying. My non glass. I think it's over there, which is a dumb place to have it. That's kind of far. Green. Light green or dark green? I'll go with dark green because there's only one light green. So we're going to go with dark green. Since you said green, I pick it. I pick it. Oh, we have to add yellow. Add something yellow. Yellow, yellow, yellow. Oh, great. Great, great, great. Great, great, great. I'm gonna use some yellow. Let's see, let me see. There's some yellow. Let's see what this looks like. I take a yellow flower. Mm, I'm gonna add some yellow flowers. I didn't. Hi, Shan. I didn't see that she's here. Chipmunks are cute. I don't know if they have chipmunks down here. I haven't seen any since I moved down here. We used to, we have them all over the place up home. Oh, is that a delivery man? Sounds like it. I don't know if I need this many, but since I'm chopping, chomping, I'm going to chomp them. Or that somebody bringing my garbage can to the house. No, I think Shannon did that yesterday. I don't know what that is. I can get one more. I just know. Thank you for letting me know. Thanks, Jeff Doug. All right. Pain on my finger. Wasn't flipping you guys off, I promise. Mm-hmm. 
Sorry for my one in your way. Put my arm out your face. Scan. Scan and a wheel and a wheel and a thing. I'm thinking. I'm overthinking it probably more than I should. I should just go with the flow. None of the flows are going. Okay, here we go. Sometimes you just got to stick it down and just go with it. Just go with it. Have three somewhere around here. Let's see, here we go. Yeah, I think that comes from having a creative mind. It's so hard to throw things out. Because it's like I can use it for this, I can use it for that. That's so useful, or I'll need it. You know, I definitely could use it in something. Oh, my coffee's turning off already. Hmm. And one more. One more. In some people's mixed media look like something, and some people's mixed media just looks like, um, you know, a background texture thing, you know, that they can add something to. Um, I do both. Usually when I do this, this Friday thing, mine is more of a finish something than, than a background. Not that it's a finished like art piece or it's a finished journal page. Or I can go back and add if I wanted to. <laughs> hey, there she is. I definitely want to keep too much. <laughs> drives Shannon poor sh drives poor Shannon crazy. See, I, I wanna I need a I need a bling bling to put in there. I have to find it. <laughs> 
Shannon, Brenda's worried about my desk because she's afraid it's going to fall over. So we, we need to like figure out why it's squeaking so bad. If my legs are going to give out, oh, my legs, <laughs> my legs have already given out. I don't keep sequins. Those things can go, go, go. Oh, are these pretty pink? I could put one of these pink dots right there in the center to bring pink in. Okay, but let's see what else I pull because who knows, it might say use pink and then I can use pink again because I haven't had to use pink yet. All right, so what we've had so far is purple, texture, hearts, and yellow. So if you want to catch up, y'all, you can. There's no, no, get away. I need a color, color, color. There's plain. So the ones that you see that aren't are plain. And then we have red, green, light green, dark green. Only dark blues left. Can't believe I only have that one light blue. Um, yellow, purple, pink. Light green. light green it is light green light green says add circles how perfect is that i'm going to add my circles right there add circles any kind of circles if you have a circle punch this is the perfect time to use it punch out your circle punches and then you can say i'm done with my punches so the only thing that i have left is my um, respirator guy i don't know what i'm going to have to do with him Maybe I won't use them on this one. Maybe I'll just use paper <laughs> somewhere. I don't know where. I'm going to put some circles, though, in there. Perfect one. You picked. You picked well, my friend. Size. I think that medium size ones. These here. You found another paint rock? She keeps finding them in at work, so we're gonna Yeah, we're gonna take them to Pennsylvania and put them in Pennsylvania. So people in Pennsylvania can find them. We gotta register though at the paint rock place though, so they know where their rocks go. Ooh, look at that guy. I'm going to give you guys a couple seconds because maybe somebody's using paint for their circles or needing to cut their circles out. So I'm going to let you guys, I'm going to give you about two minutes and then I'll see where you're at. I'm going to catch up on. Chance clear see through window on the packages. I would have saved all of those. Oh, yeah, Keisha throws everything away. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to give you guys time to, to use your figure out what you're going to use. I'm going to go fill this up with coffee before the coffee pot. Well, it just turned off. So I'm going to. Be right back. I'm gonna go get me some coffee full. I'm gonna let this dog outside so he quits staring and whining at me. You wanna go outside, Jug Jug? You're tearing this up again. Why do you why do you find things in my crafting stuff? Huh? I asked one time. I don't know, you know, going out. Thank you. 
Where are we at? How many sticks? We're halfway through, guys. Halfway. Halfway through. Pick a color stick. Usually takes about an hour. We started a little late. We started about 20 after 10, so we're running a little bit slow. Hey, Clint. Welcome. I don't know if you've ever seen, watched Spin It in here live. Glad you're here. I know uh, I see you in all, all kinds of places. I've watched some of your videos. We're doing mixed media today. We're on stick five. Need a color. Yellow, orange, plain, white. Glad you found me. I do on every Friday. After, I'm on Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. I can't remember what. Red. Clint says pick red. All right. So add numbers. Add numbers. Is there? Oh, guys. I'm cheating and I'm going to use that little number right there. I'm going to just give me a number plate. Dang straight, I'm cheating. Storm, what are you doing? Numbers always get me, guys. Storm. Oh, she's into everything. If you don't know, Storm is the one year old, I still call her kitten because she's bad. She gets into everything. Okay, numbers. <laughs> it's gonna look like I just numbered my page. Oh, I think it's sparklies on here. Add numbers to your page. I do have a coal stencil that's numbers. I guess I could pull that out and see what that looks like. Four sixteen or four fifteen? Going with fifteen. I like that number better. Four fifteen. Look at that. Nobody. <laughs> 415. I got my numbers. Is that cheating or what? Let me see where my number stencil is and see if I can work it in here anywhere. Ow. Oh, the dang thing doesn't want to, it doesn't want to come, there we go. I don't know what to say about that, hurt my finger. I have this stencil. Do this with gray paint. And I can use some of my paint that I got over there 
that I haven't used. Or I could put numbers over top of this. Put numbers over top of this and then cut that out. Let me see, let me see, let me think. Got an idea. Got an idea. Oh, Clint, I'm sorry. Is that, uh, that's not uh, Laura's mom, is it? The number 19 for COVID. Oh, that's good. How did I get paint on there? And my scissors. Stop my scissors. Um, hmm. Let me do this thought process real quick first. Don't overwhelm my brain, man. Don't overwhelm my brain. Oh, Clint, I'm so sorry. I didn't know that. I, um, I haven't, I haven't seen Laura in a, in a little, little while, so. Can't really see the numbers on there. Just looks like a bunch of. Bunch of bunch of. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see any numbers on there. Yeah, definitely sending prayers and thoughts to all y'all. whole family. That's crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Is she somewhere uh, witchy? Because aren't you her cousin? Aren't you guys cousins or nephew? That's your, she's your aunt, right? Hope I'm thinking of the right people. Sometimes you get to start seeing everybody so much, it's... Got an idea, got an idea for the 19, and then 19, 19, and then 19. Hmm. Let's see. I can do 19 with my stamps, right? Oh, his aunt. Oh, I didn't realize that. I thought that was his aunt. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, see, I'm learning something. I'm learning something. I like the 19 thing, and then it, then I can fit this mask in there. I can fit him in there somewhere. So I'll put 19 on here. Somewhere in gray. Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. Not, okay. I see. Yes, she is. She is funny. All right, I need a number one and a number nine. One and a number nine. Okay. Number one and a 
number nine. I'm going to do it right here. Be like, look for me. Look for me. <laughs> Laura's accent. <laughs> Daisies turned out great. These ones? How about they give you two number nines or number sixes when they could just give you one and you just flip it over? They charge you for the same number twice. Is that not wrong? Wrong. like a hidden message. You don't like the daisies? Sorry. Jeez. Oh, I see. Okay, I gotcha. You meant exclamation point, not question mark. They turned out great. I guess I I'll wait till you guys see the echo die eco echo 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 I know a lady named echo um I love daisies too I think that's kind of nice just hidden down there 19 You want me to put it somewhere else too? I can. I still have this color to use. Oh, aren't you guys lucky that I have this green color to use? This is like green. You can't. Oh, it's looking blue on my end. It's turquoise. Is it really? It is like looking blue. That is, if on your screen, my screen, that is like, hello, blue. Me too, mousy, mousy. Me too. My wedding was daisies, purple, and gray. The boys wore gray little uh, uh, gray shorts, white tops, button up the front tops, and purple bow ties. Looks so cute. I mean, we just had two boys. We had Shannon's son and my son. Well, my, and my son was, how old was Gatton? Uh, 10? And uh, and Shannon son was what, 16? Shannon, 17? He just turned 22, so. Corona Charlie, <laughs> Corona Charlie. Isn't that great? I found that in the old dictionary on it, in a cult kid's it's the uh, Webster's uh, beginning dictionary. And I, f I was just flipping through to pull out a page and I was like, oh my gosh, I'll have to use him. Yes, I do, Clint. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. a a on Facebook, the easiest way to find me is go find my group, Create with Becca. And if you find my group and join the group, you'll find me. Yep, Shannon does. Thank you. She's younger than I am. <laughs> I'm the old goat. I turn, uh, gosh, guys, I turn 47 this year. Oh, we need, an, we need something else, right? I got my numbers. I have to use this turquoise color. That's what I have left. And how many numbers do we have to pull? Um, we are at we're one sticks. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have four more sticks to pull. I need a color. Clint's the baby. I think you're the baby in the room. Tina turns 48. You're still older than I am. You're still older than I am. 
Oh, thank you. The picture is a year old. Took that last year in P Pittsburgh, uh, not Pittsburgh, in Pennsylvania when I was going to uh, Nisa's nursing graduation. November babies. Are you a November baby too, sweetheart? Look at that, all the November babies. What happened? Oh, it was around New Year's. No, no, it wasn't. It's was February. Tax money came in. <laughs> I did it, did uh tax money come in and all the parents got uh, got got used their money <laughs> that's why you recognize all the songs i sing <laughs> look at that i could write these down okay. and then i have tina adams b days 17 who are we missing? Someone else said November, right? Allison. That's my nephew. Not my nephew. He's my cousin. He he's young enough. He's the same age as my uh, as my son, uh, six months younger or older, six months older than my son. My youngest aunt uh, has a child that's six months older than my son. No, a year. He's a year old. 11 months. He's 11 months now. I know we do. We'll have to have to have a big party. That's really cool. That is really cool that y'all were born in November. November babies. I, uh, yeah, we'll have, we'll do something. That's fun. Yeah, I'm July. I'm a July baby. Shannon's a July baby. I'm the 8th, our wedding's the 18th, and um, uh, Shannon's birthday is the 22nd, and my grandpaps is the 23rd, and a girl I grew up with was the 23rd, and my uh, birth father's is like the 6th, I think, something like that. July's a busy month. Bunch of little turkeys. <laughs> Come on, us playing. We need a collar. And July 4th is Shannon's favorite, favorite holiday. I need everyone that's playing is like, I don't care about birthdays. I need my next prompt. Somebody pick a color. Yellow. Yellow. Oh, that was what my finger was on. How perfect is that? I'll pull that yellow. Oh, add red. Add something red. I, I, I have red. That was one of my colors. How perfect is that? So I need to know what to do with it. There, see, there's red in these roses. See, there's red in the roses. So we're good. The little girl that... um that I was a nanny for, she's getting married this July 4th. I'm hoping I can go to her wedding. It's kind of crazy what's all going on. Shannon needs to get home this year. I need to go, my, my, the wedding's July 4th. The next weekend, whatever that is, um, is my cousin's graduation. And uh, Shannon goes away for a month. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what I'm going to do. Yeah, Brenda, we just need the day. We don't we don't need all that year stuff. Oh goodness, okay. Red. Hmm. Maybe I will just put some red over this. 
see. July 20th. Ooh. <laughs> I know, but it's so hard. It's so hard not to see what keep track what y'all are talking about. I want to be part. I want to be part of it. All right. We're going to do it. We're just putting some red down. Everybody will hate me. Storm, get down. She's climbing the, uh, she's out there climbing. I can hear her. She's climbing the, uh, the, what the hell is that called? The, the, the door, the screen door. She climbs it. So I bet you Fred's out there. Frederica, excuse me. Red. Red. I guess I added red. Red. Who picked that color? You're fired. Still have to put him somewhere. Maybe I should have made him bleed in red. All right. All right, I need a color. Need a color, need a color, need a Twenty second. Twenty seconds, we are plain pink, blue, red. I have that turquoise color to use, and I have three more sticks to do it. Red. All right, let's see what that red stick says. Ready? Scribble. In Scribble, you can doodle, you can make just lines. As long as Scribble, it to me it just means you can't make it, you can't draw something. So, Scribble. Scribble, Scribble, Scribble. I need a Scribble, I need a color. And you can use any, you can use your, you can Scribble anything. Any way you want to Scribble. Just, just do it. Just do it. I'm gonna use pink, pink, pink. I'm gonna, gonna do it just like you think. I don't get along with the people that I sing. Just do it. There's no, there's no, I, where's my, where's my sharpener? You would think that I would keep it. And I thought that I did, but I did. Look at that. 
I do have it. I've been looking for this darn thing for how long? All right. Oh, sorry. I looked up there and just seen that you said navy blue. I picked the red one already. I'll pick navy blue next. All right, now I get the scribble. I'm scribbling on my paper. I'm a good scribbler. I'm a pretty good scribbler. You don't have to have no talent to scribble. Oh, I bet you I do miss all kinds of stuff, especially when I'm coloring and drawing stuff. And I, I've done that one. Well, I didn't turn off that, but I uh, I read through some and I was like, oh, I missed that. I missed this. You guys are probably silly. My silly girls. Silly girls. Okay, we need the next color. We need, I need, what am I going to do over here? Probably not a dang thing. Sorry, now that I look at it, it's like, I need it more. Get on, Get on up. Get on up. Glue that down. Let's see. Oh no. I'm cheating. We're not doing that one. I'll use this dark blue. <laughs> ink. 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 If you don't have ink, um, you can skip it like I just did. And I'll, I'll tell you what this is. You don't have to use this one. Um, Brer, 
use your brayer to smear stuff on it. I mean, I guess I could. So use ink or brayer. Those are the two. Choose your weapon wisely. If you don't have like spray inks or something, you can use an ink pen. Woman, that is not orange. I know, but I was going up. I was going up to uh, what's her name had picked uh, navy blue. Woman, maybe I'll just brayer some of this this turquoise on here. May as well. May may as well. That's what I'm talking about. I got a big clump of bread over here again because somebody. Somebody poured out way too much bread again. I have a problem with bread, I think. Maybe I'm just trying to use it up so that I don't have to use it on anything. All right. Let's get this teal out of the way since I only have two more. Let's put some teal down. Maybe. I don't know. All right, someone needs to clean up the, the glue that I got, or the paint that I got over here. It is a really stacking up. I'm making a mess. I need a new paper too. All right, let's put some, let's put some down. Um, what the heck? What the heck? I'm using the brayer that makes it really funky too. Great. All right, let's do it. I can say I used all five of my choices. I did do that on purpose, guys. I picked out weird colors on purpose to make me come out of my... Not so bad. It's not ugly. And it's not what I would necessarily have chose to color with. But it's not bad. Cheater. I'm allowed to cheat. Hi, Sandra. You guys aren't allowed to cheat. Jeez. <laughs> and I didn't cheat. Look, I did it. I went back. Still got this. Go oh, I thought that was my last one. No, I got to use this guy. Mm. Mm, hopefully something up here tells me to use them or else I'm just going to have to stick them down at the end. My eye hurt. Look. Those aren't true colors because it's not picking up true colors, but it really actually doesn't, actually doesn't look too bad. Did you pick orange next? Need a color, need a color, I need a color, I hope now. Orange stick, yes, orange stick right there. Ready? Oh, perfect. Collage something. Good job, Allison. Collage. Okay, guys, I get to use my guy. Got to collage him somewhere. job, Allison. Did you see that? Did you cheat? Let's get him out of here. Let's get you on the paper late, buddy. Let's see, where are we going to put you? How am I going to cut you out? I think I'm going to have to fussy cut you. Let's use these little scissors and see if they work. Oh, 
Oh yeah. You're going to be collaged right to this paper. Yes, you are. We're going to remember you. We're going to remember you forever. I can put them down here by the 19. And then the 19, 19, and then the 19. I guess that song. We're going to collage you down. Yes, we are. You're going to have a home forever, not in a dictionary anymore. You see, it worked pretty good for the for fussy cutting. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Should I just put him down here by the 19? You can barely see the 19, but it's there. Round off his. Where's the word respirator? Oh, I cover it up with. <laughs> Package arrived. Oh, yep. Merlot is red. Pour your wine right on top of there. Yes, ma'am. Do I need to slow down for you, Eva? Are you doing okay? Round his shoulders off. No. Don't move. Do you need a flower to be hide behind? Maybe I need to hide him behind a flower. Open, open out of a fly flower. Um, because he's just kind of there. Yeah. What did you get? What did you get, Deb? We want to know. Inquiring minds want to know. We're going to just glue you down, buddy. Or we could just stick them down here. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to stick you down here like that, right, but right underneath the 19. There you go. Our memories of the way we used to. Hear him with some words. What kind of words? Bite me? Bite me words? I kind of like seeing them. Rest, 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 oh, rest. Where 
Where's my ink pen? I'm even going to put ink down. Ugh. Barely tell it's a nine now. It's hard to tell. Nineteen, nineteen. I could stamp COVID over top of them. Dude, it got really quiet. Sorry, guys. It got really quiet. I'm like, wow. <laughs> like, holy cow, wow. Maybe everyone's working real hard. Let's see? So far, these are my favorite ones. These stamps, these letter stamps are just the right size. B. Hopefully, I don't spell it wrong. All right. Numbers, even numbers. I kept them in order, huh, Eva? I, because I don't know. If I'm just guessing. It, it, but it was numbers because I didn't pick words. Did I? I don't think I picked words. No, I don't have no words on here. It's numbers. Was a scribble yes scribble it's numbers then scribble kind of they're kind of in order over here yellow yep yellow i got them in order now so it was circles yellow numbers scribble and then these two go together either brer or ink Next time I'll keep them in order. Guys, remind me that. They're kind of in order over here because I kind of just throw them down. Uh, 
I'll do better. Okay, coffee time, drink. Color. So I've used all my stuff. So, so now I'm just, uh, we have two more to go. Let me count to make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we've done 10. We're done. Well, we're you're done. Now tell me if you haven't used all your, your five Friday fives. Well, you have to. So now if you haven't, so if you didn't use all your five Friday fives, what you need to do is you have to, those would be your last things that you do. Not anything else. You can't add anything else. You have to come up with a way to use your five, your, your, your five things at the end. So that's not so bad. That turned into a nice little collage kind of, kind of thing. He's down there at the bottom. Oh, Eva, it's all good. No, no, no. Don't be sorry ever, ever, ever. Nope. Don't be sorry ever. Does he craft with you? Do you ever get him? Is he able to sit down and, and try to make messes with us? I have a little boy that come, will, uh, once this mess is over, he'll come over. He loves to craft. Scan's little brother. He's seven. He'll be eight this year, but uh, he likes to call out. He likes to, he loves pick the sticks and we sit and we do artsy fun stuff you have nine you have you've got okay so um these are probably not in the right order because i know what was the first thing the first thing was purple so purple and then it was texture and then it was i don't know hearts maybe I got some red collage uh, circles. Did I add circles? Oh yeah, those were the little insert circles. Yellow, so it was yellow in, in circles. Numbers, scribble, and then we have uh, ink and brayer. Was that 10? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, and then these two are kind of one. You can pick one or the other. Napkin. Napkin was three. Where is my napkin? I put napkin down, but what did I? Oh, I used napkin for textures. So napkin. What was purple? What, what came after? I put purple down, and then I did... Now that's purple. I don't think it really matters, but I can't remember. Are you sure the napkin wasn't number two? Yeah, I use a texture. I use a napkin for texture. Oh, you missed their circles. I'm going to keep them in order next time. So we know what's going on. <laughs> So if you participated, take a picture right now. That's what I forgot to do last week. I, and then I kept forgetting and kept forgetting and kept forgetting. Uh, take a picture so that you can add it to the page. There you go. I got my picture. So uh, you can add it to the Create with Becca page and share. And then maybe other people will see it and be like, oh, I want to do that next week. Here we go. Very nice. So who wants to see the gorgeous pit papers that I made yesterday? I'm sure you are all waiting to see those. They are so pretty. Wait until you see them. They turned out so stinking good this week, this time. All right. There. Let me clean up just a tad. Oh, I think that 
that's where this goes. Oh, oh well, that, that's right. Where's the turquoise? Purple. This needs to go back up there. And this needs to go there. Look at me picking up. Clean up, clean up. It's time for area to clean up. Clean up, clean up. Oh, 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 dang. Sorry, I really hit it good. My goodness, I use a lot of stuff when I do this. Oh my, oh my stencils. Oh, I still have that pretty napkin I can use for something else. Like this. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Get it. My belly just made a really weird noise. All right. Let's have my dog wanting him to come in. The frog. Let me go let him in too. I'm going to put this here for you guys to look at and tease you. I'll be right back. Here he whining. Oh, I'm speed racing. Go, speed racer, go. Skedaddle. All right, look at these. Oh, my goodness. What's Deb say? Tomorrow there will be more. So who's selling tomorrow? What's going on tomorrow? I mean, I know Jen Evers. She goes on. And I don't know where Natasha was last week. Anyone hear from Natasha? I hope everything with her is okay. Who's Ashley? Tell me. Uh -uh. Artsy, is she having a sale tomorrow? Artsy, Ashley? All righty, look at this. Let me turn this off and see. All right, so I have these beautiful, look at that, these roses that dried that I'm going to be able to do stuff with. Look at how pretty those are. So um, these aren't that pretty. They look aged. That's about all, which I kind of was wondering what would happen. So they kind of have like this just green tint to them. Can you guys see the green a little bit? So I'm, I'm not real impressed with those. And they really didn't do anything to the pages. And then I have all these gorgeous rose pieces. They're nice and dried. There we go. Yeah, she is. She's in the morning, but um, she wasn't on last week. And I was kind of concerned and wondering where she was. So, yeah, these turned out even really good to use. They smushed, they smushed good. This one's really good. There's just can't, can't see that one, the shadow one. Anyways, so they're not ironed or anything. This is a piece of, this is a thicker. This is not just the regular copy paper. Um, uh, tonight is uh, uh, Katie. Katie sells tonight. So this one's really pretty nice. It's real thick. This is the thick uh, card stock that I did. Oh, there's some more roses. Look at how pretty. There we go. Look at that. This one. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Look at that. 
the purple that it came out. Just a red rose. Turned out beautiful purple. Um, look at this. Can you see that detail? Once that's iron. I mean, this is this is a thick piece too. And that I there's the leaf. And down here. There you go. Look. And these turned out. Look at those colors. These turned out gorgeous. And that same thing with this. It's just. Let's see if you can see it. The green. This just has that green tint to it. So I'm not really impressed with with the laces. But look at this one. Oh. I mean, how gorgeous is that? I almost want to frame it. The leaf. Look at the leaves. This again is on the thick paper cardstock. And then the bags did much better than I thought. So you can see the leaf pattern on there. I mean, it's nothing really great, but it has this has some really pretty coloring to it. This page came apart on me, or this bag came apart on me, but it's still usable. Look at that. You can see that leaf print. These turned out so good this time. Look at this one. I mean, that purplish blue is just gorgeous. I want to do more. Shannon, Shannon, uh, the cringy bags. Yeah. You like those? Make sure you send me your address. Send me your address, please. Do I have your address, Deb? Um. Ooh, look at that. This purple is just amazing. It is so vibrant and just gorgeous. Yeah, these are, I put a little bit of vinegar in. Yep. I didn't use, I didn't use my alum this time. This. Were you here yesterday, Allison, when we layered them? I think you were here. I mean, look at these. These look like little guitar picks. I mean, this is just amazing. This is a, this, oh, you can't see it. This is like a turquoise color. Oh, and then we put the cards down. Look at this. You can see the shape of the flower on there. And then this is on the back. And this one, look at this. Look at that. Wow. I didn't look at these. I just picked them up. I wanted to save my, you know, I, I mean, I've seen them when I picked them up, but I didn't look, look at them. Look at these purples. Work under fabric journal. Oh, good idea. I just had some of that. I know exactly what you're talking about. That would be, yes, that would be a great idea. And you know what else? Oh, Storm just knocked something over. You know what else? I've used cushion. I did this on a Christmas journal uh, a cover. Um, I wanted to use fabric and paper, but the paper didn't, you know, it looked smooth. So what I did is I put fabric underneath the paper to help cushion it. And I bet you that stuff would work for that too, to give it like a cushy. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. I, I have some of that stuff. I guess it's not getting thrown away. The detail, the detail. Oh, I wish you guys could see the detail. 
on that. Maybe when I take a picture of it. And this is just, this is regular paper. This isn't thick paper. So it was a little bit harder to get off, you know, get apart when I took it out. So some of them ripped. Look at that color though. People are leaving. I can't believe people are leaving because these are gorgeous. <laughs> these are gorgeous. Babe. I hope I'm not the only one that thinks these are pretty because I just, look at the purple. The purple is just blowing my mind. I don't remember getting that purple color out of my roses last time. I think this was the bottom sheet, maybe. That's why it's more brown. That splash of purple in there. I don't know what I'm going to do with these. I just am really enjoying making them. I'm going to make some more. Dang straight I am. And look at this. You can see the where the paper was laying on top. This one. I bet this one was laying right there on top. Yeah, it was right there on top. So you got the, the dark. And this last piece. Oh, they're just gorgeous, huh? Gorgeous. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Now they need flattened. Which you can iron them. I need Shannon to get the iron for me. Now, do you guys want to see the two boxes that I got? I honestly don't know what um what they are. One's big, one's small. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What is in my boxes that I got? Shannon did not have to use a uh, wagon. Hey, Scrappy Doodle. You just, did you get to see my pretty paper? Uh, thanks, Eva. I just, I made some really pretty paper yesterday. I'll probably make some more. This is um, a lady that sells and she rescues puppies, dogs, and all the proceeds go to help her with um, the care of the pets and finding them homes and all that good stuff. Looks like two stamp or dice, I don't remember. These stamps. Close to my heart, oh yeah, look at those. Those are fun, like Mandela kind of things. She sent me a sample of 3M tape, which I've seen this guy sell this stuff and it, he sells it really cheap. It's double-sided tape. Um, I guess, I think what it is, is he works for some place that uses big rolls of this and you know they cut it for whatever they need and then they have these pieces and then he sells those pieces and I thought about doing that oh and then I got I got the different I like that she sent them in the, in the package containers too the little squares although I think now I might have this size I might have bought the same thing or mine mine might be longer let me see or mine mine might be more Let's see. Did I buy the same thing? They're already come on. That's why I have to get these in order so that I can find them. I'm looking for them. Someone's a loser. Arts. Could someone please come over here and organize? We're not asking Brenda. Poor Brenda doesn't even have herself organized over there. We've seen your room, Brenda. Come on, I know I have them. We used them the other day, didn't we? Those are all, those are all fairies. I know I have squares. I know I do. I'm, I'm slowly sliding out of my chair. <laughs> slowly getting closer and closer. My head is getting, there they are. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, they're different. These are more square. 
than these and these have the stitching and this doesn't have the stitching. That's, that's probably why it caught my eye. I like the little packages. It makes me want to maybe get these with the closures. And then this one, oh, I don't have to take it out. Some more like Mandela kind of thing. And then to make, you know, I like those those lines, those listings, list it, listing. Oh, I like that lovely, sweet. Nice. Nice, okay. So I'm put, I'm just, just slip this in there for now. Because then they're organized. <laughs> Move these back here. And I'm excited to use this because I almost bought some. Uh, it's supposed to, you know, it's 3M tape, so it's uh, it sticks. It's Joseph Tabby is who sells this. And he shows it like all this stuff, but we'll see how that works. And this is from... Katie, maybe? Betcha this is from Katie. Did you hear your name, Brenda? Is that what you're saying? What? I was saying I need to organize and I said that uh, but not you. You you need yourself organized. That's what I'm saying. Poor Brenda always like I heard my name. All right, let's see what's in this package. You guys, one of the days I'm going to make uh, the inside. So keep your boxes. We're going to use this on one of the Friday Fives. The corrugated paper, that's fun to use because you can use it for texture and all kinds of cool stuff. So keep a box. I know you think, like you have anyone like Shannon in your life. It's sometimes hard to keep around. What is this? Oh, oh, I got some tool. No, this, I think, yeah, this is tool. Yep, I guess I'm make a black uh, veil. Um, some blue. This is this is like a chiffon, I think. I think it's a chiffon with a line in there. Feels like a chiffon. Let's see. That is something on here. Made in Japan. Yep, chiffon. I know my favorite. I'm gonna say it, so I had to get a degree to get. Oh, that was one of the things we had to learn. This is tool. Tool has a tool has holes in it, like you know, like a you know when you wear a wedding veil and it has that. Which one's usually a little bit. Which one's going to be more expensive? Uh, so pretty! Oh, look at the butterfly! Butterfly in the sky. Uh, some neat fabric. Got some little flowers. Yeah, this must be a Katie box. Stripes, which would go with the flowers. You keep seeing the nose. Have a nice, have a nice pointy German nose. Lattice, I don't know. Is that lattice? Oh, this is like a ooh, that it's not that blue. This is not that blue. <laughs> ooh, but look at these two together. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, I'm thinking this was a build a bundle. I can't remember. The price doesn't seem like it is though. 
it's usually photo bundles are five or ten. And this is a this is an odd number. But yeah, this is definitely Katie. I like how she sticks everything in. And, you know, I can reuse that page cover. These are pillowcases. And dang straight, I'm gonna use them as pillowcases because I think they are adorable and cute. Oh, <laughs> I'm showing you off the screen. Aren't they cute, the little peacocks? Shannon, if you still here, I got here, I got us two pillowcases. Even if they go on our spare bedroom, they're just they I just love this. It just reminds me of something you'd have at your grandma's house, right? Like she sat there and did this. I need to pick this up. I I would like doing this, I think, sitting in front of the TV. I mean, they're yellowed, yes, but I mean, they're old. Throw them in the wash and there you go. Um, I, and I think Katie does wash her things, but I, I'm going to throw them in our wash and, and there you go, because this is, this is a really nice fabric. Now it's all hand done. I'm not going to cut that up. I just seen them and I was like, I like those so much. And they're yellowed. Of course they're yellowed. They're used. I buy them at a yard sale. Why not buy them to use them? They're going to get washed. They're going to get washed and I'm putting them out. They're so pretty. This is turning out pretty cool. What's turning out pretty cool? What did I miss? Yeah, exactly, exactly. And those are really nice. They're nice and thick. Yeah, Katie does. I, I like shopping with Katie. You can trust what you're getting from her, no problem. Ooh. Oh, this is that stuff that has the, um, it has the like backing on it, she said. Yeah, it must be like a curtain fabric. That's my guess. I mean, with this, that that's like a, uh, you know, they used to use it for, uh, it's probably, it's probably, uh, what's that stuff that can kill you? Um, asbestos. They used to put asbestos on the back of fabrics and use it as um, weather. Like, what are they called? My mother had them. We always switched out our curtains uh, in the wintertime. Yeah, like an insulation, I guess. Yeah. That's really pretty. Look, they're big old branches. That's something. Ooh, and it goes with that blue, too. There's a dollar. I think, I just thought the little flowers were so pretty. I won't don't sniff it or eat it. So, and then I got myself an old book, The Fable, The Fables of Espos, Espos. I don't know how you say that letter. Let's see. Old book, you know, I ha I saved them. Look at how it's just all cut, you know, like how do you say that word? E A S O P Espos. Look at that. Look at that. Is that pretty? Copyright 1931. See? Long E. Esop? Esop? Is that Esop? I don't know. Look at this though. I just love how old it is. Destroy evil before it grows. The lion wearied Jupiter with his frequent complaints. It is true, he said. Oh, Jupiter, that I am frightened by the crowning of a cock. Jupiter replied, I have given you all the attributes which I possess myself, and your courage never fails you except in this one instance. On this, the lion groaned and lam lam lamented very much and repro reproached himself with his cowardice, cowardness and wished that he might die. As these thoughts passed through his mind, he met an elephant and came near to hold a conversation with him. 
After a time, he observed that the elephant shook his ears very often, and he inquired what was the matter. Just as the moment a gnat settled on the head of the elephant, and he replied, do you see the little buzzing insect? It, it, if it enters my ear, my fate is sealed. I should die pres presently, the lion said. Well, since so huge a beast is afraid of a tiny gnat, I will no more complain nor wish myself dead. I find myself, even as I am, better off than the elephant, in the very same degree that a cock is greater than a gnat. The greatest have weaknesses. I need to make this. Oh, look at that. Oh, I remember her selling this. And I was like, and then she told me the date. And I was like, well, I need, I need to save that book from being cut up. And it's still in. Got the gold. I am the saver of all books. Not all books. I can't afford them. Um, I think this is a winning, right? Oh no, I got these. I got the, the little cards, the B cards. I thought they were cute. The bumblebees. Now I have bees. We're gonna do something with cards too. We need if you have a card, set of cards. I don't have this napkin, and I thought it was it's a whole whole napkin. And this is like a burnt orange, so that will be nice on a page. Napkin over there. Still a little bit more. Let's see what all what I got here. Where's my there it is. Look at this. That's a bird. And uh it's really uh this is pink, not purple. I don't know on your side, but bye scrappy. Bye, Alice. I'm sure I'll see you around. Birds, 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 birds. Oh, and a cupcake. Look at these. So these are like little panels. Um, it, it's actually one. It is a panel. Let's see. It's Westminster. Is the Fairy, fairy tiptoes. Oh, look, there they are. There's the little fairies. This would be really fun to, to quilt around. Do some quilting on, what is it called? Top stitch quilting, I think is what it's called. That's what I like to do. And then this one. I really do need to get something for when I'm sitting there because Shannon likes to come home and relax in front of the TV. So I like to be in there with her when she's relaxing. It says believe. And just some different and some frames. There's some frames down here. What's this one? Vogue. This is a Vogue by Lizzie B. Creative for Henry Glass and Company. Uh, henryglassfabrics.com pattern number. You can go and get it. Flowers. I don't know how old this is. Look at that. Look at that. For and for if and when I do my steampunk, I thought this would be a fun, fun thing. I, I think that's what I. Oh, let's see what this says. This says, oh, sorry, guys. It says, believe in pink. Believe in laughter. Be strong. Happy girls are prettiest. Believe in tomorrow. Believe in miracles. Believe in you. Believe in kindness. Be brave. Dance, twirl, skip. Believe in honesty. Believe in friends. Believe in magic. Believe in happiness. Be joyful. Cheerful girls sparkle. Believe in you. That is beautiful. I love it. That is beautiful. I might need to cut that right out and do some quilting and hang that in a frame because that is that is beautiful. And it's in a cam, it's in a not cameo. What's that on your side face? 
Love that. That's beautiful. Love that same. Ooh, what's in here? All the way in the back. There's something. Oh, this is from Allison. And she left. This is from Allison. Oh, this was a giveaway. And Allison gave it to me. I remember. You won this. Thank you, Allison. No, I might as well turn them all, all upside down. Ooh, tiger. Lady. These are pretty. I like this one, I think, the most. The boat's pretty cool. Cool. Katie's on tonight. Oh, and an envelope. Did I win this too? Oh, no. Oh, no. These are, yeah, these are cool. She, these are uh, just her. Oops, sorry. Blimey on that one. They all, there's some. They're, uh, what are these called? We'll be using these too. So if you have any, fine, know where they're at. Um, doilies. These are fun. I bet you she has a die, die cut machine. I don't know. I would say, yeah, and she cut these out. I Maybe they sell them like this. I don't know. These are little dots. Yeah, can you see that? I don't know. These are fun though. Because you can use them this way if you don't like this side, but I like using doilies. Fun. And then this one last thing here. Um, I think I bought this to use too. I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember what this is. I think I bought it to some daisies. Yeah, look at that, just a daisy runner. I love this old stuff, I tell you, it is just, I think it's just so pretty and people, you know, the run, using the runners and stuff, it's just a, a thing that's gone and it needs to be done. And this, what did they say? Oh, this is to keep your teapot when you're making hot tea, you put this over your teapot. I didn't know what it was. That's what they said, you know, to whatever, what are they called? Brenda will know. And you put it over your teapot to keep your tea hot for when you're taking somewhere and then you take it off. But um, this is, you know, on, on just a quilt and then it had butterflies and stuff. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. I like it, but I don't know if I'm going to uh, keep it as what this is, the tea, tea cozy, yeah. That's it. Thank you. Um, or if I'm going to, you know, use the, the fabric as maybe, you know, an art or something. And that is my goodies. How about that? And Katie, this was from Katie. So if you're interested, it's Katie, Katie's tribe of five. She comes on Fridays, every Friday night, and she sells a mixture of fabric and books, and and then you can tell her things that you want, and she tries to get them on her sale and all that good stuff. So, um, I guess it's time to go take a break and watch a movie, you know, that kind of thing. And um, I won't see you until Monday unless I get bored and I come on and I surprise you guys, which has happened a few times, especially with Shannon working these crazy hours. If you didn't post, I would love to see what you've created today. I would love it. And everybody else would too, because I think that helps them feel more comfortable on posting theirs. So if you did, I'd love for you to post it. Just post it Friday five, post it. And in the group, the group is Create with Becca. Thank you all for spending the morning with me. I'll see you Monday for a uh, messy Monday. I don't know what we're going to mess, but I like making messes. Yeah. Yeah. I need to get my printer in here and do some scanning, I guess, because you want those, you want those, uh, you want my, my uh, fingernail polish prints. You want some of those. I guess what I'll do is I'll scan and I'll put it, put it in my group and then you can download it from my group. How does that sound? I just got to get my scanner up and running and connected to a computer. Right now it's just sitting in a room, not connected to anything. But uh, thank you. Thank you all. I had a great day. I had a great day. Keep spreading love. Bye.